Hi there, well Cardano's ADA is one cryptocurrency that is starting to look more positive today, while many others continue to struggle. So let's check it out. It has been on a downward trend since the start of May, but it looks like ADA is starting a new path of recovery. ADA gained more than 7% over the past 24 hours. A large portion of trading volume for ADA comes from Binance and Upbit. It is in seventh place with a market cap of well over 5 billion US dollars. IOHK has announced the release of the KVM testnet, and this is the first smart contracts testnet for Cardano. So let's take a closer look. Smart contracts must be formally verified so they can run exactly as specified and are free from bugs or flaws. Only then can they be widely adopted as financial infrastructure that can be relied upon by billions of people. The KVM is a correct by construction version of the Ethereum virtual machine specified in the K framework. This technology produced by runtime verification with the support of IOHK is the very first time that a complete formal semantics of the EVM has been produced. According to the team, this is an important first in cryptocurrency that is a necessary step towards the promise of third generation blockchains. The next Cardano test is expected to be launched in July. Now this is a register based virtual machine similar to LLVM with an unbounded number of registers that supports unbounded integers. According to the post, developers will be able to write, compile and execute smart contracts with improved security and performance compared to the KEVM testnet. IOHK recently posted on Twitter that it is looking for a talented functional complier engineer to join its growing in-house team. And on May 10, IOHK posted on Twitter that it will never ask anyone for ADA, Ethereum or any other cryptocurrency. It said that it never runs giveaways or any similar promotional schemes. It warned people to be careful about online scams. Thanks for watching and don't forget to share your views and predictions in the comments below. Bye for now.